guys, it's Katie and for today's video I'm going to be doing a really exciting video. Personally I'm really excited for this. I'm going to be doing my nighttime skincare routine. Now before we get into this video, um, this is not what I do pretty much, this is not what I do every single night because it's Sunday, I usually do have a pamper day Sunday so I'm going all out today but uh, sometimes I use more products, sometimes I use less, the majority of the time I just use face wash. Um, and moisturising lip balm that's literally it or sometimes like micellar water if I have makeup on but uh, I'm going all out on this video so before we get into the video <laughs> just said so before we get into the video so if you haven't already go and click the red subscribe button and hit a like if you enjoy and click the notification bell so every time I upload you get notified and yeah let's just get into the video so as you might be able to tell i've got eyeshadow on and a bit of tinted day cream but i need to take this off so to use it um, let me just shake it up a bit i need to take it off with i'm going to be taking it off with the garnier skin active micellar cleansing water this is sensitive skin they do a few really really hydrates my skin whilst cleaning cleaning it so that's really great so i'm going to use that to clean my face it's so good i'm actually running out of it so i need to repurchase it oh and guys look at the state of my nails they're literally chipped i think after this no tomorrow i'm gonna paint them because they're really bad um sorry if you can hear that noise um i don't know what it is but anyway so i'm just gonna pour a bit on sorry guys i don't even have any cotton pads so i'm having to use tissue uh, this makes my skin feel really refreshed and it doesn't sting at all and it makes my skin feel really clean and just refreshed and hydrated and it soothes as well. Oh my gosh guys, look how gross. Oh sorry guys, it's, I know it's my wear, it's really disgusting. Now my skin at the moment, it isn't awful, but it's not the best it's ever been. I can remember, like, I think it was the week, my skin was the best it's ever been. Oh my gosh, guys, it was amazing. Like, my skin was so clear. I didn't have, literally, I had no spots whatsoever. No blemishes, no, um, literally nothing. I just had clear, glowy, spotless skin. But, uh, this is really, really nice, and I really enjoy this so it's really nice and it's really affordable as well i think it's like three pound but it's so so good um and i love it so yeah so i need to thoroughly take this off and i'm gonna be using a toner after i've done the next step which the next step is probably my um the funnest part but anyways I think my family are watching today's but my skin as you can tell i'm not sure if you can see or not but i've got like a spot here spot here spot here no that's like i think that's like a scar i'm not sure but my skin's are awful it's just not like the best anyway my cellar water done this is all done now so there we go so next i would usually use a um face wash but i actually don't have a um any water with me um so i can't use a face wash um but i um in my next sort of skincare routine video that i'll do i'll try my best to show you like how i wash my face what products i use but i usually use the clean and clear advantage spot container wash oil free and it's got spot fighting technology clears spots fast help prevents future spots and it doesn't over dry your skin it's so good it gets rid of spots so quickly it's literally amazing and i absolutely love it i do recommend to get it it's three pound fifty and it's a really really big tube anyway the next step is a face mask so well face mask um so i've got a few i can even use my simple kind to skin deep cleansing multivitamin uh face mask this is like a cream face mask that you just put it on oh 
What is that noise? I have no clue. Anyway, it's I think it's my family um watching Teddy downstairs. But sorry about that. But anyway. So I can either use my simple face mask or I can use one of my seventh heaven fast face masks. I can use my black seaweed one, passion, mini honey, green tea, tea tree, or this is one that I think I might use. My cucumber clay mask, three minute wonder for all skin types. Um, our three minute cleansing clay mask works to draw out those nasty impurities and unwanted excess oils from your pores. And I've got really bad pores. Leaving your skin cleansed, toned, and beautifully soft. This is a clay mask. Um, even though it's not quite, it's not very hard to take off so i'm going to use this and to apply it i'm going to use my flat foundation brush but i actually use it for a face mask i don't know if you guys look at the marble print it's so cute and you have to leave this on for three minutes so not too long and it smells so nice it makes my skin so soft and smooth look guys it's literally white it makes me look like santa literally so uh i'm just gonna start by putting on my chin smells so fresh and clean it's amazing it looks like i'm putting nothing on but guys honestly i am because my 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 skin's not dry i mean i don't have dry skin sorry guys i can't talk um but i don't have dry skin uh um i'll glam that i don't um but i have a sensitive um and oily skin my skin's not like extremely extremely oily but like even now my skin is oily um and i hate oily skin because my makeup just goes really shiny and i hate it but, oh my gosh it just makes my skin feel so refreshed and clean afterwards and it's got antioxidants in it which is really good for your skin it cleans out your skin oh my gosh guys look <laughs> Now, lastly, my forehead. Honestly, guys, I do really recommend to get this. It's so, so good. Um, if... If there's any, like, good moisturisers that you guys recommend, uh, please let me know, because I'm actually looking for a new moisturiser, even though... Got two moisturizers left, but they're just not. No, no, they are good. I just really want like another one. Uh, but basically, my skin is all white now. Um, because I put on the face mask. Um, it actually looks green in the tube, but it's white on my face. I literally like a ghost. But I'm gonna leave that on for three minutes whilst I talk to you guys, and then I can do my next step. So yeah. So guys, um, oh yeah, I hope you're all staying safe and well um, during this madness. Um, but yeah, I just hope you're all staying well. Um, how are you guys finding quarantine slash lockdown? I'm finding it okay, actually. I love going on walks. Um, we already went on walks before, um, but we're just doing... Um, I just love going on walks now. I don't know why, I just... I feel like I've kind of liked m walks more now than I ever did, even though I still love, love, love going on walks to get some nice exercise. Uh, but yeah. Um, so yeah. Do you know what I'm going to do whilst I'm waiting? I'm going to moisturise my arms. My arms are really tanned, by the way, guys. I don't know if you can see. Uh, but what, uh, what body lotion should i use i might use i'm gonna use this soap and glory body buttercream with shea and coconut balm lime and almond oils and kiwi water juice so it's really refreshing it's gonna really soft oh my gosh guys it smells so 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 like sour i've got a little bit left but i'm gonna moisturize my arms in the meantime i've actually got a clock in my room so i'm looking when it gets to like in the middle um because it's currently 709 right now uh i just smell really like summery when i put this on and it smells divine um it's 
very nice so oh, oh also guys um tonight i would usually use an uh, i can't even speak usually i would use an exfoliator um but i'm not going to be um using that i'll use that no i know i'm going to use it i'm going to wash my face when i've done everything and i'm going to exfoliate um but I, obviously i can't show you guys um because i don't have any water um but i am going to exfoliate later on so that's what that's the step that i do do and i've missed here that's great even though i don't really need any here okay what's the time i'm trying to look at the time guys it's been about two and a half minutes, so another 30 seconds. Um, yeah, I actually need to sort out my skincare drawer because there's a few things that I've um, had for a long time, don't really want them, stuff that I haven't used and I'm going to give away and stuff like that. Um, oh, you know what? I forgot something. I was meant to put on hand cream. So I've got three hand creams I could use. I could either use my Avon Care Glycerin Hand and Nail Rich Moist Hand Cream with Jasmine Vitamin and Glycerin. This smells beautiful. My Garnier Extra Dry Skin Intensive Restoring Hand Cream. Or my Nivea, my classic Nivea, <coughs> sorry guys, Nivea Protective Care Beeswax Hand Cream. I might use my... Um, I don't know, guys. I might use my Avon Rich Moisture hand cream. Guys, I cannot tell you how amazing and it just smells really like when you're going to a spa. Yeah, it definitely smells like when you're going to a spa, like that sort of smell. Let me put this on, guys, and then I can take it off. Hands are so smooth. It makes them so smooth and moisturised. I love it. It's going really dry now um so i'm gonna take it off and i'm gonna to take it off i'm just gonna use my garnier um sensitive skin micellar water takes off anything it's so so good guys i cannot tell you how much i love it i haven't had it for that long actually i've only had it for like three weeks maybe and i'm literally got the teeniest bit left um but i'm gonna use that to take it off uh this i'm going to use to take the base i don't know if you can see it, but it's like white um this is what i'm going to use to take the base of it off and then i'm going to use a toner just to remove any makeup residue or uh face mask residue oh my gosh guys it feels amazing when you take off your makeup don't know about you guys um but it makes me feel amazing I don't know why I'm saying ow, oh, I didn't even hurt myself. But anyway, right. So I'm going to take off the last bits and then I'm going to tone. I would rather use, uh, no, I love cleanser. I absolutely love cleanser, but I feel like toner is just amazing. It's really hydrates and cleans my skin. Oh, by the way, it's part of the cucumber range again. Uh, it hasn't got the label on because the label came off, but I just love using toner, especially my toner that I have. It just really, really hydrates your skin, and I love it. Oh my gosh, there's still makeup residue coming off. Now, I know I'm aware that it's not all off, but I'm going to use toner. I'm going to use, this is from the um, Cucumber range again, um, just the labels came off, but this is such a good toner, guys. I've literally got the teeny spit left. Uh, just need to shake it up. Okay, it's not uh shake it up oh my gosh guys it hydrates my skin and clean guys i just can't tell you how amazing it is it refreshes my skin so much and i love it um sorry guys right so i've actually got i'm actually standing you guys upon my mirror but this is what it looks like uh smells nice again and it just really refreshes and cleans my skin oh my gosh guys it feels amazing um a lot of um sometimes i do tone sometimes i don't majority of the time i just use cleanser from where makeup i just use cleanser take to take it off and then use face wash moisturizer and lip balm the thing is with moisturizer i don't need moisturizer because i don't have dry skin at all but i like to moisturize just to make my skin extra smooth and soft why is this why is it not good? 
but it's literally amazing and I love it so much. Oh my gosh, guys, it just makes my skin so glowy and clean and I love it, as I've said, like a gazillion times. I might do a morning skincare routine um, soon. I tend to do more in the night time than I do in the morning, I feel like, because I don't like to overload my skin just because I feel like if I overload my skin, then I tend to get spots. Uh, but anyway, I'm trying to rub my skin. I know it's not necessarily good for my skin, but I've toned. I might cleanse again just because it's not coming off. And the thing is with toner, it does remove makeup very well. But the thing is with clay mask, the nightmare to take off. So I'm going to have to go in with a bit of my cleanser. So let's go. It just, I don't know if you can see guys, but it's like makeup residue. I can't tell you how amazing this cleanser is. And they do for dry skin, combination skin, oily skin, sensitive skin. The pink one's sensitive skin. I just got the sensitive skin one because I feel like I don't want like, my skin to look, be like it to work. So my skin is, it's not like extremely sensitive. Like if whatever you put on it is going to react. But the other day I did have an allergic reaction, guys. You didn't want to see it. Uh, that's when I was actually going to film my skincare routine, but I didn't because my skin was that bad. I literally have spots everywhere because my skin was so red and tight, and that's when my skin was dry. But okay, that's the best that I can do. So, um, yeah, it's my skin that feels really tacky and refreshed and lovely, and yeah. So, what am I going to do now? So, it's time. Oh, usually, oh, sometimes I would use uh, my uh, glycolic acid toner, but I decided to use my cucumber one because I love it. So now it's time for moisturisation. No, that, I don't even know if that's a word. It's time for moisturiser. So, the uh, moisturiser that I'm going to be using, same as the toner, it's from the same range as the clay mask and the toner, the cucumber moisturising lotion. Um, it has added on antioxidants. Will it hydrates and smooths your skin, leaving you with nourished and beautifully soft skin. Looks like this. Smells nice. Usual. It's just amazing. Oh, sometimes I would use my Nivea Soft, Freshly Soft Moisturising Cream, Jojoba Oil and Vitamin E one. But I'm gonna be using this one because it really, really hydrates my skin. don't have a lot it just looks like that no i'm actually gonna put a bit more on but yeah sorry guys also i've got the tub version of it look it's the tub version of the cucumber cream uh but i just rub it in my hands and just put it on my skin and just press it into my skin i don't tend to like moist like put it on my fingers and um rub it in because i feel like it just i just like to press it into my skin my skin's really warm, actually. And when you're um, cleansing and moisturising, go upwards, because otherwise, if not, your skin will start to sag, and you don't want your skin to sag, guys. So that's why I push it upwards. Um, so, yeah, my skin feels nice and moisturised and smooth. So now I'm going to use a bit of a serum. Sometimes I don't use serum. Sometimes I do. Um, but I'm going to use my Tea Tree Overnight Calming Blemish Serum. Really good. It just helps with blemishes and gets rid of them, really, overnight. Um, it doesn't say it gets rid of them completely, but it is a really, really good serum. Really good. It just stops, like, redness on your skin. That's what I love. Don't use a lot of it because it is quite strong stuff, but... It's really good for just helping with redness and penetrates the pores as well. It contains salicylic acid. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, I just put it on my chin, my nose, a bit over my corners, and then, yeah. So that's my serum done. 
So sometimes I would use an eye cream, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I actually, um, actually no, I'm going to do that. I'm going to use a bit of extra moisturiser. And I just go underneath my eyes to make sure my eyes are extra moisturised. It locks in the moisture. So... moisturizer should i use what? actually i'm gonna take some of my nivea soft freshly soft moisturizing cream revitalizing cream um hope oil and vitamin e and just put it under my eyes to moisturize got some there put some underneath there it makes my eyes really smooth i don't usually do this i usually use an eye cream but i'm just going to do this because it just so highly effective look it says nivea soft is a highly effective revitalizing moisturizing cream for everyday use the light formula with vitamin e and jojoba oil is quickly absorbed and refreshes the skin enjoy the invigorating feeling that leaves your skin soft and support all day long and I, Nivea is one of my favourite skincare brands. I swear by Nivea. I absolutely love it. But now we've done that, we're going to do, I don't, sometimes I do, yet again, I don't usually do this. But what I'm going to do is I take my eyebrow brush um, and I take some Vaseline Aloe. Um, just because I feel like Aloe is quite good for your skin anyway. And what I do is I take like the brush end or if you have a spoolie that should be fine. I just rub it in the Vaseline and I go um just brush my eyebrows up because it tends to make them more th um I find that it makes them stay in place and that's what i like about it just makes them stay in place and makes them healthy and yeah no i just create the shape that i want them there we go so i do the same with the other eyebrow i hate my Right, I've always, I've always had like a good eyebrow, and a bad eyebrow. My left one's pretty much always been my good one. My right one, I just hate. There we go. So now I use it on my eyelashes. I'm quite fortunate because I do have quite long and thick eyelashes. But I just go across my eyelashes. Just makes them healthy. Makes them. Oh no, I wouldn't say it makes them grow more makes them healthy and long and yeah so now i've done that put that away and lastly i'm gonna use some lip balm because my lips kept really really dry I just like to keep them moisturized and smooth so i'm i'm gonna use um no sometimes i will use my nivea lip butters um but i'm gonna be using my nivea soft rose lip balm put a bit on yeah so that's my skincare routine done skin feels moisturized clean yeah so my skin feels glowy oh sometimes i will use like hydrating oil or whatever but because i've got oily skin i don't tend to put oil on my skin this is my um skincare routine um i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you soon for a, another video so bye guys